What is in a word? The race for Watertown mayor. One word with the two candidates now feuding. 7 News reporter Brennan Straub has more on what is missing and who it matters to. It's election season. Watertown city streets dotted with campaign signs. But it's this one that reads Compo Pierce, mayor, that is drawing criticism. A lot of people are turned off by politics and they don't follow the news. And so there are some people who really, truly may not know who is in office and who's running. Ruggiero feels her opponent, Sarah Campo Pierce, is misleading city residents by not including the word for on her signs. I think it's pointing out the difference to people uh, and making sure that they realize that, uh, you know, she's not running for re-election or anything like that. She's running uh, for the position for the first time, just like me. In response, Campo Pierce feels her signage is common practice and does not violate election law. She feels her opponent is trying to shy away from the bigger issues at hand. Like I said, my campaign's focus is talking about the issues and demonstrating to people why I have the experience and am the best candidate to be mayor. I won't engage in negative campaigning. I won't engage in the mudslinging. Campo Pierce says Ruggiero fails to mention the sign's wording is similar to others running for city council, like Leonard Spaziani, whom Campo Pierce says Ruggiero supports. Spaziani says that is not the case. I should have never been dragged into this. It was planned by them, period. She's lying if she says, well, you know, maybe, maybe uh, she's assuming that I conspired with Lisa on that. I knew nothing about it. Spaziani does have new signs going up that include the word for, but he says he decided a while ago to switch his signs. Brendan Straub, 7 News.